Hello everyone. You are watching this video because you are interested in learning programming and this is designed for kids. And I will show you step by step uh, the minimal installation you need to start this class. Because we will start this class for the language Python, we will install the Python runtime in our local machine. If you are using Windows, um, you will be able to see the Windows desktop in my machine now. What you can do, just go to any of your browser and in the search box or the address bar of the browser, you type Python download. And this will take you to the home page of the Python download option. So you can see that uh, Python download coming in the list as highlighted and choose whatever the default option showing you in the downloads page for the python.org website. So we can see that it is now asking us to download Python version 3.8.4. Just go ahead and say Click there and it will start downloading and installing. So you can save it to your local machine or you can simply say run. If you say run, what this will do, this will download and then start the installation then and there. But you can always save and install. Now this will ask you where do you want to install this Python runtime to. So you can choose a specific directory. If you want to put it in, let's say D drive, you can always choose that. You can customize the installation so i will go with the default and then one thing you should do you should add the python 3.8 to path variable this will help you use the command prompt and then do it from the command line utilities so i'll say install now and then this will kick start the installation process the python 3.8.4 for um, 32 bit so this will just go ahead and then do the installation pretty quickly. Once the installation is over, we'll, we'll see the, the Python runtime from our command prompt and then start our development process. So this is the minimal installation you need if you're using Windows operating system. Install the Python runtime for from python.org slash downloads. Once the setup is successful, you can see that setup is successful. And then you say close, you come back to the start menu and type command. And this opens the command prompt. So let me and then if you just increase the font size, let me just do it here over here so that you see it better. So let me go ahead and increase the font size to 24. Okay. And then if you just start typing Python, if the path is correct, then you will see the prompt immediately. You can also try with this. Come out of that command prompt and say Py. This will also show up the Python script. So that means you are good to go. Just in case you want to check if the Python um, libraries are installed properly, you can go ahead and then type print hello and then this will print the hello in your screen so this means the python is running that is the minimal installation you need to work with my python basic class we'll see when we use editor like visual studio code how to install that but that's in a separate video thank you very much